Well, a very good evening to you on what is pretty close to an ideal evening for football. There is a barely a cloud evident. The world and his wife have gone to great lengths to be here for a match of great consequence and massive interest in these parts. Barely a breath of wind, so the football has no excuses for not being at its very best. The teams I know are pumped for this. They are fantastic scenes in the stands. There is a great sense of drama here, a great sense of their excitement and expectation. This place simply a monument to the game. So much prestige, so much pride, so much passion whenever football is played here. The action has already started. He's got away. Di Maria. Forward it goes. Could move up a gear here. Gets the better of his man. Berati does well to read it and intercepts. It is early, but the game hasn't yet sparked into life. Heave to the back post. Foot in. Who's loose? Who's getting there? Well, both sides have actually looked poor going forward. We've hardly seen anything meaningful yet. Neymar. Mbappe. And the counter is on. Vague positions himself well and cuts it out. Oh, he's gone for it! Goal! Paris Saint-Germain! And Paris Saint-Germain take the lead! Paris Saint-Germain are really pouncing on any stray passes in midfield. We're talking seconds from interception to the back of the net. It's counter-attacking heaven. Paris Saint-Germain take the lead, 1-0. Still a fragile lead, though. They can't afford to sit on this. Neymar. Here it comes. Mbappe. He gets past his man. Chance to break. Right through the middle. Gets away from his opponents. With a delicate ball. And the ball is out of play. Thiago Silva plays it forward. And it's Di Maria. Pablo Sarabia. Well positioned to make that interception. Bagge goes looking. Idrissa Gay drives it forward. Nantes get it back again. Loose ball, who's going to get that? Looking to break out here. Ferretti. He's got options out wide. Neymar. He's had a shot! He's scored! And already they're looking to run away with it. He was urged to shoot, and he duly delivered. Yeah, it looks simple, Peter, but it requires intelligent use of space and, and good understanding to pull it off. Paris Saint-Germain have a couple of goals without reply, it's 2-0. Well, that second goal has given them so much more command and confidence now, and they should be able to take it on from here and either add to their lead or, or close it out. Surely they'll manage one or the other. Some good stubborn defending there. Good run, ultimately thwarted by an astute piece of defending. 
Crowd appreciates good football all round there. And that'll be the last act of the first half. Reflections on the first half? Well, it's looking pretty straightforward, Peter. They've got themselves into a, a very good position, so why dither from here when they can repeat their first half success with a, another show of strength? Paris Saint-Germain go in at half-time on a comfortable two-goal cushion. And we are already promptly back on the way. Thiago Silva. Pablo Sarabia. Palois. Mbappe. Yeah, that's top defending and preventing him turning, which can open up many possibilities. It's come loose. Good ball. Kozawa does well there. Alert. Meunier. Di Maria. Meunier. Mbappe. And that's sprayed out wide. A real chance to break. Kozawa battles to win it back. Paris Saint-Germain with his two-goal lead. They are certainly looking much the more a short side. And it's Fabio. Oh, nice touch. He is not one readily to admit defeat. Don't be surprised if he tries that again. Fabio... Mbappe! Looked to surprise the keeper, but missed the target. Well, it could have been and probably should have been a, a different choice of finish. There was lower space to hit. Sorted that out. Neymar. And now they can launch a counter. Well weighted. Mbappe has a pop! Yes! And the lead is three! It is surely done! It just came down to a battle of wills between him and the keeper, and he won it with a cracking piece of trickery. making consecutive changes here. Three without reply. This is becoming a stroll. Played into space out wide. And helps available out wide. And he's onside. Whipped in. Well, to be honest, I think they're all showing no substance. Where's the final product? Di Maria is the guilty party there. Oh, that's neat. Just brushed off the ball there. Ball's out on the left now. Nantes uh, keeping their men at arm's length here. Yeah, I just think it's a, a conservative move to deny runners the opportunity of, of going beyond that rear guard. Tries lifting it over. And it's got through. And that has put pay to that. And it's played forward. Cavani. Mbappe, a scorer already in the game. Well, no question as to who's winning the battle in midfield at the moment. Some very... He's one-on-one, -on -one, short! He's gone for it! Comfort, yet more comfort, easing away. Well, you know, thinking about that, I think they've perfected that on the training ground because it took them seconds to get the ball from back to front and they really commit forward in numbers too. That was all very well drilled.
It's become a case of men against boys. And the referee brings it to a close.